In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to insert a document or object directly into the body of an email in Outlook on Office 365. We'll walk through each step together to ensure you feel comfortable with the process, making it easy and intuitive for you next time you open Outlook. Let's dive right in. First, we need to start by logging into your Microsoft Outlook account. Open up your browser and navigate to the Microsoft Outlook login page. Once there, you'll want to click the Sign In button. This is the entry point to access your emails, so make sure you're entering the correct login details. Type in your email address and click Next. Then, you'll be prompted to enter your password. Carefully input your pass password, being mindful of any uppercase or special characters, and click Sign In. If you've enabled two-step verification, you may need to verify your identity with a code sent to your phone or email. Now that you're logged in, you'll land on the Outlook dashboard, the hub for all your email management. It's time to start a new email. Head over to the top left corner of the dashboard and click on the New Email button. This will open a blank email form where you can start drafting your message. With the new email window open, move your cursor to where you'd like to add your document or object. Select the body of the email by clicking inside the area where you typically write your message, just under the subject line. This ensures that whatever you insert will pop up exactly where you want it to appear. Next up, let's locate the Insert option. If you look at the upper part of the Outlook window, you'll notice a menu bar with several tabs. You'll find Insert nestled right between Message and Format Text. Click on Insert to bring up a range of options for adding content to your email. From here, you have several choices, including attaching files, inserting pictures, or even integrating an object like a calendar event. Depending on what you're adding, follow the corresponding prompts to select your file or object. Once you have your document or object inserted and ready, it's a good idea to double check everything, including the recipient's email address, the subject line, and the content of your message. After confirming that everything looks good and is in place, head over to the top left of the email composition window once more. You'll find the send button there. Go ahead and click send to dispatch your email to its intended recipients. Congratulations, you've just successfully inserted a document or object into the body of an email in Outlook on Office 365. Practice this a few times and it'll become second nature. I hope this guide was helpful and that you feel more confident using Outlook's features. Thank you for watching and see you next time for more handy tips and tech tutorials.